Grape wine disease are devastating and it can destroy the entire vineyard if not identified and controlled in time. That is the reason it is included in most of the wine courses and it is a topic in hotel management course also under beverage section. So here we are going to learn about seven different type of wine disease which are most common in the vineyards around the world. Number one is the downy mildew Plasma para viticola. It is a white fungal disease which is on the lower surface of the leaf. So this is the identification of this disease, this particular disease that this fungi is developed on the lower surface of the leaf and it makes the leaf yellow on the upper part. So the upper surface will get the yellow spots and eventually leaf dries up and drops slowly. Now we know without leaf, the plant will not be able to produce the sugar which is required in the grape which eventually by fermentation becomes alcohol so it is important so leaf uh, has a very uh, important role in wine making and also the berries become water soaked pale yellow in color and they also drop and this disease is common in the cool humid climates number two is the powdery mildew Ancinula niceta it is a powdery fungal growth develops on the upper surface of the leaf and berries so this is the difference between downy mildew and powdery mildew that downy mildew develops on the lower surface of the leaf and powdery mildew is white color powder which can be seen on the upper surface of the leaf the affected berry don't develop properly and become hard and crack so the development of the berry stops and they eventually become hard and they crack and the cloudy atmosphere and winter encourages this type of disease. Number three is the grey mold, Botrytinia fucalina. It is a pathogen. Greyish soft spots can be seen on the surface of berries, leaves, stems and flowers. So it develops a very soft uh, kind of uh, uh, spots. Develops uh, in the moist condition. So usually rainy season. It develops on the berries first and then puncture the skin. So it, uh, first of all, it develops on the berries. Wherever it founds the moisture, uh, it develops and then it punctures the skin and dehydrate the grape. So if in ideal condition it is good also like noble road wines are made by this uh, particular fungus uh, so, such as in Sauterne we have this uh, uh, particular uh, grey mold which develops on the Samilian grapes and we have in Hungary which is Tokaji and uh, also we have in Germany uh, which is Spartlet's wine. So these all wines are made by this type of uh, uh, fungus uh, but it need a particular weather that after the wet weather there should be a dry uh, weather which, uh, which controls this uh, uh, fungi. Number four is the black rot Gignardia bidwellia. It is a fungal disease also very common in US. The fungi develops over winter and in spring in fact more new wines during wet warm weather. The grape leaves get black spots, later they rot, shrivel and drop. Number 5 is the Phylloxera, Dactylosphere vitifolli. It is caused by the microscopic sap sucking insect that lives and eat the root of the grape wine. It damages the roots due to which entire plant dies. In 1860, this particular disease had destroyed much of the European vineyards and there were very few vineyards which were not infected by this disease. It had come from US. It was so devastating that the Minister of Agriculture and Commerce in France announced a reward of 20,000 francs, which is equal to $1 million today, to anyone who could find a cure. But the cure was never found. The only solution was grafting on American rootstock. So we graft the wine, we take the rootstock, the lower part is the American plant, and then we will we will graft the uh, European species on top of the, on the American rootstock. The American rootstock had the quality that it has a sticky sap. So whenever this insect used to feed itself, uh, it will block its mouth and it will not be able to um, harm the, uh, the plant. Number six is the Pierce's disease. It's, it is a bacterial disease caused by Zinella fastidiosa. This bacteria lives in the xylem of the plant. Xylem is a water transport system through which all the water, whatever root takes from, that goes 
from the ground to the plant canopy. This bacteria disturb the water supply. Leaf become yellow, dry and drops. It is spread by insects. Number 7 Grape Vine Trunk Disease also known as GTD. It is very destructive. It reduces the lifespan of the vineyard and increase the cost of the grape. So the grape will be expensive because the wine will die fast. Uh, as normal wine um, lifespan is about 30 years. Although there are some wines which lives for 100 years and more, but uh, usually it is 30 years. Uh, so if you have this type of particular disease, then the wine will not, uh, you know, last longer. It will die soon. It caused by fungus which grows through the wood. So it grows in the trunk and block the xylem and phloem. In simple words, we can say xylem transport water and phloem transport sugar. So both these activities stop, all the growth stop and slowly wine start dying. So thank you so much for listening. These were the seven most common vineyard disease which are found around the world. If you have any comment or question, you can write in the comment section below. Thank you so much for listening.